Welcome back everybody. Uh, this is the last part of my uh, uh, camper repair and I think this is going to be a pretty quick one. Here I'm just placing the uh, two half inch uh, uh, plywood to trace out the uh, shape and here that I have cut it to replace the uh, area that I removed and everything glued up. Here I'm decided to uh, paint the back side of the uh, aluminum, the diamond plate aluminum, just to give a little more protection. And uh, I'm using self etching uh, primer. And here I'm mixing up the uh, epoxy to cover all of the uh, wood piece, uh, the replacement piece. And I use the uh, deep penetrating uh, epoxy uh, normally this is what's used for like a repairing the uh, rotten wood in this clip I'm removing the uh, section of a plywood where the face is the uh, delaminated and uh, I applied the epoxy for the protection in this area as well when all the epoxy dried and cured uh, I just used a construction adhesive to uh, install the replacement piece. After a few days to let the uh, construction adhesive um, dry and then went back and put a uh, undercoating and this is what I use the um, black beauty fence post and it's more of a paste it's it's not a paint I mean it's I guess it is still a paint but it's very thick and uh, I think it's very good stuff and I use two coats once the undercoating is dried uh, only thing left to do was to install the uh, aluminum trim all around the uh, bottom the uh, bottom of the wall Then it was time to assemble everything back together. Uh, first thing that I have to do is to uh, make sure the trailer is ready. Uh, I had to flip it back to the normal side because I was working on the back side of the trailer a little bit and reinstall the axle, spacer, and so forth. First of all, I don't know what happened to this clip, uh, but somehow it's very flashy, and so sorry about that. But this is where I'm trying to uh, push the uh, trailer back to the uh, under the um, the camper, and it just inching little bit by little, lifting the front and sliding the uh, trailer, and you know very tedious time consuming and like it says I uh, took about probably about uh, two hours to get everything uh, situated uh, back to the uh, assembled So I was actually doing this a few months ago and um, so right now everything is all finished. Uh, I finished installing all the trims and lights and so forth and it's back to the uh, campable uh, trailer now. <music> 